Arsenal fan TV, I mean, quite an easy victory in the end. And Addy Boy or Whit missing today? I mean, Tottenham are a mess, aren't they? Uh, I hope they kept the receipts from the 110 billion they spent in the summer because they're going to need some refunds, man. And their, their manager is an Arsenal fan. What more? I mean, it's unbelievable what sort of a state they're in at the moment. But um, mm. the, the last two games actually have uh, really hit home how lucky we are to have Arsene Wenger. I know a lot of people have been saying about players and everything, but I think he deserves a shout out. Mm. I mean, we're really getting the benefits of him being here for 17 years now. Um, he's uh, there's been 12 Tottenham managers uh, since he started. 14. 14 is it? There's actually 14. If you include Tim Sherwood, it's now yeah. 14. If okay. you include the fact that David Pleat did it three yeah. times, 14 oh, okay. managers. Oh, 14. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you count yeah. David Pleat yeah. three times, yeah. fair enough. Um, but yeah, and then I think the overall record is 19 victories for Wenger and five for mm. other Tottenham matches. So that says a lot. I mean, longevity is massive. But I mean, uh, I'm not just going to blame that just on Tottenham. But it's other football. It's just a fashion fashionable these days that managers I mean Cardiff in our last mm. game um, I don't know why they've got rid of Malky McKay he's doing a great job and surprised they've gone for Solskjaer I mean I'd have thought they'd gone for Phil Brown um, <laughs> he's the only one that can manage a ridiculous town in my opinion but uh, yeah uh, in terms of Adibai your that's another sad indictment of Tottenham that they're relying on one of our cast offs I mean He's obviously got the ability, but he's going to um, show it for a few games and run everywhere, and then he'll just disappear. And he's obviously, he's obviously a bad apple in the squad. And Koscielny had him in his pocket today. Mm. He and, didn't get and, looking. And Soldado, I mean, 27 million. Yeah. Again, the defenders today, we've got to give them a lot of credit. I thought Monreal as well. Exactly. They really, really coped with um, that attacking 4-4-2 and we've got to remember I mean we're here we're saying it was quite an easy victory we must remember they've just beaten Manchester United with the same team exactly well you know Man United have lost a lot of teams this season but <laughs> and uh, regarding Soldado yeah another um, good clean sheet for our defence um, but again Soldado's only scored I think one goal from open play this season all the rest have been penalties so but yeah it's uh, in terms of the magnitude of the game and the number of players we had out it's a massive victory I know people are saying stupid things like oh it doesn't matter if necessarily if we go out of the FA Cup but that's a ridiculous statement I mean even if this is a pre-season friendly I'd be well up for this game we can't lose against this lot and um, in terms of momentum for our season it would have been massive not mm. to go through this and you know we can't be picky and choosy what trophies we go for we shouldn't won anything for eight years so who knows this might end up being you know our best chance um, obviously the premiership is looking great at the moment but 